How transmissible is COVID-19 Delta variant? And how effective is Sinovac against Delta variant? Today, I'm going to present to you one of the latest real-world study that show that Sinovac has an effective role in protecting you against the Delta strain. Let's watch this. So if you like my video, please click like and subscribe and the notification bell so that you'll be notified for any new uploads to come. We all know that the Delta variant of the virus that causes COVID-19 infection doubles the risk of hospitalization compared to the Wuhan virus or to the Alpha variant. And in fact, the Delta strain is now considered as the most dominant strain worldwide. So just how contagious is the Delta variant? We know from studies that its transmissibility is two to threefold higher compared to the original Wuhan virus. The Delta variant can infect as much as five to eight people. And that's the reason why the healthcare system in our country at present time, because of the Delta surge, has overwhelmed the healthcare system. We know that the risk of hospital admission for those who are unvaccinated or just partially vaccinated was shown to be pretty significant in a study in England, where in approximately 43,000 COVID cases, three quarters of those who were hospitalized were completely unvaccinated, and 24% of those hospitalized only receive one dose. What is very amazing is only 1.8% of the 43,000 COVID cases assessed in England were patients who had been fully vaccinated, showing that vaccination really works in protecting you against hospitalization. Other studies likewise, including the United States, have shown the same imbalance of cases between the vaccinated and the unvaccinated in regard to hospitalization due to COVID-19 Delta variant. Clearly, the researchers have exactly the same finding, that the risk of being admitted to the hospital was more than doubled with the Delta variant, and that more than 90% of the hospitalized patients right now are most likely the unvaccinated. So clearly, therefore, when you're fully vaccinated, it does not offer you 100% protection. There is what we call as breakthrough infections. And if in any case, somebody that you know suffers from a breakthrough infection, do not blame the efficacy of the vaccine you received. Because whether you received Sinovac, whether you received Pfizer vaccine, or the J&J vaccine, or the AstraZeneca vaccine, there are breakthrough infections because all of these vaccines don't offer you 100% protection. In short, always remember, it is actually not the efficacy of your vaccine that made you suffer a breakthrough infection. Whether we're talking about Sinovac or the Pfizer vaccine, the rates of breakthrough infection has been shown to be the same. But what's important is that most breakthrough infections among the fully vaccinated have been relatively rare and mild, which means if you are fully vaccinated, should you be concerned about the Delta variant? Definitely. If you're living in an area where case numbers continue to fall, then you're pretty safe. But if you live in a place where cases are rising, like in the Philippines, if you are with someone who is at high risk for serious COVID-19, then it is very smart to continue wearing your mask, double mask, and practice social distancing. We all know that Sinovac, which is the widely used vaccine in our country and other parts of Asia and China, has made a lot of worries due to the possibility of lack of efficacy against the Delta variant. What the world knows, however, 
is that China's inactivated vaccines, whether we're talking about Sinovac or Sinopharm, continued to be very protective during the recent outbreak of COVID-19 in the southern Chinese province of Guangdong. The data from their experience has finally been published, pending review, which now provides us real-world evidence about the ability of Sinovac to stave off the highly infectious COVID-19 variant. This paper tracked more than 10,000 people, including those infected and their close contacts during the outbreak that started in late May and mid-June. The two shots of Sinovac and Sinopharm vaccines provided a combined efficacy of 59% against COVID-19 caused by the Delta variant, 70.2% against moderate COVID-19 infection, and almost 100% protection against severe disease. But one dose Sinovac only offers an efficacy of 13.8% single dose. What is important in this real-world data finally to be published in Lancet is that the protective effect of the two-dose vaccination against the Delta strain reached 72.5% among the study participants between the age 40 to 59. The vaccine efficacy was actually higher among female participants. What's important is there were no severe and critical cases or deaths among the vaccinated participants with Sinovac, and none of the 16 severe or critical cases were vaccinated. This real-world data paper, therefore, clearly shows that the inactivated vaccines like Sinovac can really help prevent people from getting severe COVID-19. If you look at studies looking at mRNA vaccines like the Pfizer or the viral vector vaccines like the AstraZeneca, they were found also to be effective in 88% and 67% against symptomatic infections caused by the Delta variant in an English study. And therefore, all of these COVID-19 vaccines altogether appear to be highly effective against the dreaded Delta variant. Clearly, therefore, the solution to this present pandemic and the Delta surge is none other than to get vaccinated. Remember, all of the COVID-19 vaccines approved for emergency use listings from the World Health Organization are truly effective based on clinical trials against severe COVID Delta infection. It is best, therefore, that you get your two-dose vaccination of whatever vaccine is available in your area. But again, don't be complacent because with this more transmissible Delta variant, don't forget to protect yourself further by using your mask properly. Remember, do not bring your mask down to your chin when you want to eat or talk with somebody. This will contaminate your surgical mask. But most importantly, during this Delta variant surge, please double mask properly or use the KN95 that will fit snugly into your face. For those who uses the surgical mask, wear one disposable mask or a surgical mask, then put a cloth mask on top of it. The disposable mask that is underneath a cloth mask that has multiple layers of fabric should push the edges of the inner mask snugly against the face meaning a snug fit mask is critical to avoid COVID-19 infection due to this more transmissible Delta variant. So this updated video on Delta variant and efficacy and effectiveness of Sinovac, I hope is a welcome news to us all who have been vaccinated with this inactivated virus vaccine. This news regarding its good effectiveness against the Delta variant is what we have been looking for. This real-world data comes from a province in Guangdong, which has been fully vaccinated with inactivated virus. And with Delta surge, you can clearly see that they have already reduced the number of transmissions and number of cases using this vaccine. Again, this is Dr. Jaritan. See you again soon.